Next tonight, a Nottingham man who was devastated after losing almost all of his sight has found new inspiration by taking up painting. Stephen Brazier from the park was a keen photographer and bird watcher, but had to give it all up as he started to lose his vision in his 30s. Now in his 60s, his former hobbies have inspired him to become an artist. His work is appearing in a local gallery and he even has a one-man exhibition coming up later in the year. Sharon Wallier reports is Stephen Brazier's painting studio and looking around at his work it's hard to believe that he failed his art A level at college. Stephen was once a town planner with Nottingham City Council but things drastically changed when he began to lose his sight in his 30s. I've always been very short-sighted uh, since I was a child um, and when I got to 36 um, I got macular degeneration in, in, in one eye and then a few years, not long after I got it in, in the other eye. That's something that old people get very commonly, but because I was so short-sighted, I got it when I was in my 30s. The worst loss, actually, was bird watching. I was really keen bird watcher, and although I'm still involved with bird watching, I still write about it, I still try to see them, they're very difficult. I listen to them now, but I couldn't, you know, I had to more or less give that up as a practice, a sort of actual hobby of going out and so that was that was the main loss really but Stephen decided to pick up the paintbrush a few years ago he's almost completely blind but can make out silhouettes of people and places and can see the smallest of things close up with part of his left eye with a little help from technology he's developed an interesting method to help him paint I use uh, this iPad here which uh, enables me to enlarge an image so if I want to see those trees I can get right in there and see where they are and, and so on and then when I want to put the paint on again I get really close and um, can see which bit I want to put in and I can keep going back and forth like this and uh, end up with paint all over me but it seems to work I, I uh, take a lot of photographs often candid photographs of people in the street or on buses and they, the people strike the most amazing poses. His dedication has paid off. Three of his paintings have been chosen to appear in the University of Nottingham's prestigious summer exhibition. I mean, I've been, been being in friends because I'm so pleased to get a picture in this exhibition that uh, you know, I feel like showing off a bit. I don't feel too, too modest about it. And it's, very, it's quite, quite a, an honour, really, to get somebody who doesn't know you to pick your pictures out of... All the ones that go in. The exhibition runs until this Saturday, and Stevens already managed to sell one of his pieces. He's now preparing for his first ever one man show this September. Sharon Walia, Knott's TV News.